Rox trying, but not able to quite secure it. No CC was really left to be had, and everyone else able to disengage Ooh. properly. But now, they the play towards topside. They do they see Faker, go. and the Cocoon's not going to land, though, so can they get anything else? The Flash Chase, it's Smep onto his face, looking for a little bit more, and he's not oh. going to go down. Faker, with just the Ghost, gets away with it's it. It's another dive. No Flash available for Sven, but a good stun from the Slicing Maelstrom. This should be a relatively easy kill, unless MLXG can get involved. Looking at the mini-map, who's coming up from the jungle and oh, Sven's in trouble. Onslaught of Shadows available. Oh. MLXG jumps out, but Sven gets away. Unfortunately, Haunts has found Xiaohu. Xiaohu not going to use the petrifying gaze, and Sven makes it out alive. A lot of uh, potential in the mid, actually. Senkux is in trouble. No flash, remember. Yeah. Avenue Field comes up. Very good equalizer. That'll cut off at least one of the paws. Oh. Beautiful! Such a great sidestep! Juve does not look Cassiopeia in the eye. Give it to follow. There's on the hunt. Splice. They want to try and make something happen. In goes Looper. Trashy gets into the back line, but he just doesn't have any damage. Uduzi is tearing apart this team. And Kobe can't do anything. Oh. Another arcane ship. Pop goes the support. Out of the way of the wall. That's the triple. That's the triple kill for Uzi. The poster brushes can change the entire game because they got them two kills. Got Bjergsen ahead. Now Sven's in a little bit of trouble here because there's still some teleport right available. In. Good combo in there, Sven. He's going to go down to fly from the to save him. Safe cuts to safety. My pin up now. Double lift. Takes out Rafe on the other end. He's getting chased by Cube, but Biafrost will pay the price as Rule against the trade. They're banned in two games as well in the semi final. Oh, oh no, 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 here. Okay, well, there we go. This is going to be problems. Ambition is low. Oh. Okay, H2, what was that? They've killed Ambition! Ambition for the team to be in as well, because they picked up the best bottom lane in EU from spring to summer, but have just not found consistency for their top lane play. Six days fought out. It's going to oh. get more! Oh. Aframu saves the day! Puts up the wall! Six a flashes to safety! Glacial Fisher comes down! Afro's still buying time! the base here, so this is a little bit risky. Certainly is. Tunnel comes back out there. No, there is none around the Baron Pit. They have the damage to get it done. Oh! He got it! Are you kidding me? Somebody blocked Sack Kalmar How can you let him do that? That's impossible! The most ridiculous Baron steal! Albus is a hero! The scout's still down there in this turret. They get to the attack, but they're going to eat up the traps, and here comes the play. They brought in Spam. He's oh, the back baby. line, and Scout's Beautiful. nowhere to be seen! They're getting evaporated! Assassinated in the Lightning Storm! This is all they could possibly need! Clear Love running out of hell. Scout nearly just nothing to do anymore. Jumps back towards the Fountain. Who even what? cares? Hey. And Peanut, who actually stays alive! They flash to keep him up in this one, and this should be the game! Roll for Forgiven and Vander. They don't chase into the darkness. RJJ was waiting in the bush, but Samsung, despite giving up first blood, they're up in CS, they've got a minor gold lead. Oh. Juve sidesteps the Sonic Wave, uses the hammer, and sends Yankos away. Follows him after slaying the Syndra, and they're gonna keep running in. Stay out, blocked up by the Roots. Ryu grabs the double, now Smurf carting it out with a frozen mount and a bit of help from Miracle. Damage is almost enough, but now for Given's turn to turn it around. They're looking for Ryu, but they can't get it. Miracle, gonna get his face screwed off, he's not That's careful. A triple. Ryu gets himself a triple. Quadra. There's the Quadra, now gonna chase it down for the Panther. Liquor it, don't give it away. He's bailing back to the Fountain. Mount Drake's, it speaks to their strengths of being able to burst out the Baron, and they're hoping to get oh, Rock to pull oh, out. It's Rudy, oh, they're going. Oh, oh, oh. Teleport's coming in. Curtain calling. Wish have already been used. A trick is running away. Expect gets caught down. He's got a PA, remember, but he needs Megan. Oh, oh no! Delete it! Remember, I've seen one A G2 or Ace. And, and that was very preemptive, especially because Ryu has the mid lane push. He can respond much more quickly than his opponent. And Theos has to respect that. Ow, Kira's actually ow. in trouble here. That's a lot. Kira in one trouble. Q. Ryu needs one more. Can he land it up? There's the flash. There's the Q. Solo kill. First blood for Ryu. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, couple minutes. The potion. potion. <laughs> Always pop your potion early in the trade. Like ambition was going to get there in time. Meteos just on the edge. Shockwave in the mid lane. Petrifying oh. ace. And a Jensen. He flashes. Oh. 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 Jensen comes up with a clockwork wind up. This is exactly the matchup that we were talking about. Oh, we had a soul strike one one despite the first line. How much can they really get prey oh, to the back turn? Look right. Bang, looks for it all. He's got one. What else can he get? It's going to be Blake in his sights. He's coming back. 
Baker's low. How much more can they get? The stun's coming in, and it's Duke with the big play. But the turnaround from Prey turning it back in. The chase, the resonating strike, and the ace goes through for Peanut. These fights are out of control this game. And off to the base. Complete surprise. He's likely going to be at least one summoner blown here once Smoothie combos. And the question has been is the communication there between Smoothie and Medios? For sure it was on that one. Crown moves fast. Oh, he gets smoothie. the stick though. Petrifying gaze. Smoothie gets taken down. Flash and Knight is down. They're on the crown now, but it doesn't even look like they'll get anything out Time. of it. Up. They're down in the bottom lane. Shahu's left alone. He hops over the minions. Sidesteps a deadly flourish. MLXG's looking for the kill. Sonic Wave connects. Resonating strike. Duke might just survive. Get Mega Guard coming up. The boomerang. The excitement. Oh. Oh. XG, the rest of SKT, they break open the base. Inhibitor in the bottom lane is now down. There, but the rest Rox of is also here with Rise. This is a bit of a two versus three. Do they have the damage on Smep? One more shot, I'll do it. They switch back into Kuro. They get one. Now, how's the trade kill gonna work? Yeah, they get a crit, and Death gets it. Now, the battle versus Gorilla Flash. The oh, deals through the Ignite and is running for dear life. Oh, he's Vengeance, all said and done, though, still advantage Edward Gaming 3 to 2. That was some vintage depth mechanics right there with the flash. I think Smurf maybe caught one. He's looked to Peanut here. He's gonna keep his verdict him out of the way. Peanut does dodge that one, but the stun's gonna keep him against the wall. He's coming. He's coming. Peanut's looking for it. Smurf gonna try and keep him out. Peanut wants it. Throws the needle. Good. I keep Peanut looking for the steal. He does it one more time. Steos is dead. There is no smite from Alpha's Nux. They, they got a tower. They got a tower. Oh, this game is so crazy. I can't believe it. And they got Elder Drake. Oh, man. With Elder Dragon. Alive because Top and Hib has been killed. And they even got the pickoff on Bang. Rox doesn't actually have to stop pushing right now. They can delay the recalls. The arrow. Look at the arrow. Look at the arrow. He's got teleport. He he got he's got it. it. He's stopped too. Which means they can push. It's now on Wolf. It's a teleport coming in for Smith and Kuro. How much more can be done? are gone and it's too much. SKT are here to defend. This is a difficult 3v2. Pushing down Duke down below a thousand. But the re-engage on Gorilla means nothing because suddenly Peanut is here on the Olaf. A flash force yeah, out of Gorilla but he is still chasing on the death who's nearly out of HP. The chase in oh, for Prey. First blood. That's two for Peanut. It might be a third and the re-engage for Koro One. Can he do much of anything? It doesn't seem like a lot. Peanut very very low. Oh. Slicing Maelstrom. Spev says don't you dare go for my teammates. Another one. Rocks time. Tigers, four to one. And it's an extension of the play earlier where EDG couldn't get the secure. Rox is then there for the counter gank. And he's too frail, gets one shot by a lot of these, you know, additional damage that's been thrown around. Oh, actually, Baker shoots it. In back on Medios is here, but so is Bangy. Medios covering, eats the cocoon. He's gonna catch it on the way through, SKT. It has that only so many objectives this world. Do not out. repel, gets away from us, and he goes in for it, and it's secured by Bangy. That is a big deal. SKT, By the time the late game hits, Rundle will have that push away, but that's why Smep's roaming in. Got this coming in, the flash to push him back, but it's not going to be the cocoon, and the shockwave buys all the time Faker needs. 1v3, easy escape, two summoners down, but he's okay. And that is the second gank that SKT has been able to absorb. This is just fantastic play. This was gorgeous. He respected Deft enough to know he was going to be able to dodge the Q, lands it onto Mako, that lines up the kick on a Deft and lets Yang pick up the kill, and then this move from Yang, is just awesome. He knows he's gonna hit Mega. Flash Nar gets the extra damage against the turret to secure the kill. Gorgeous. We're out of the fight. And ANX, they just need a little more. But that's not enough. Chaos jumped out again. Gorilla with a huge play. Fights up with the pulverize and a miracle cutting it out. But he's actually gonna get out of the way here. So much there is the more gonna pop and miracle still fighting in. Needs to line up. Gonna try and get down. Like, right. Save this map. Gets him with the flash. He's alive! Gorilla gets the eye by Oh, oh Peanut Miracle! Are you oh. kidding me? That's exactly what they gave them! And they had X! They might have enough for a caught again. And oh, Kira does get the ulti off, but there's the calling down. Kira forced a fat flash over the wall, but HUK is still going. Because Liquid goes blind. He sees nobody in the top lane. He must know that they. HUK. <laughs> <laughs> he got him over the wall. Seven Fates get a miss, but what a snipe there from Kira. TP down from ANX. They're going to try and.
The damage that can still be put out here. Clear love to make something on. happen, but no. Oh. They swarm the members of EDG. Odo Omne trying to focus Clear Love in the back so he can't disrupt the fight. Mouse on to Forgiven, but he pulls back on the chrono break, and Forgiven's open to fire oh, away on Kaylin. They have the targets they need in their eyes. Oh, oh doing damage with the stars. It Forgiven. falls for Forgiven. Love, and Forgiven's coming up huge. Those are two kills from Pawn. He's going to push. Oh, no was <laughs> up. He spawns into it. Forgiven's the last one left. Mako's there to do what he can, but it's so mismatched, it probably won't be it. Forgiven alive, the triple kill for Forgiven, and it looks like H2K will soon. Yeah. He's gonna get hit by the Sonic Wave, his MLXJ is gonna follow up, should be able to get it out, but oh, there's the King flash. flash. Tidal Wave comes in, there's the knockout into the Aqua Prison. See you later, Trashy, and MLXJ safeguards out. Just beautiful play there from MLXG and Mata. Taking him off the Alistar, he's still making plays on the Nami. The kick flash into the tidal wave, into the bubble. Perfect CC chain. He knew that Trashy had no Ragnarok from that earlier play in mid lane. And as far as them being able to get the pick, they killed Ruler and then they go and make this push. Exactly. Here is Samsung's attempt at defending their Nexus with a single Nexus turret left up. Ooh, Crown. Flash by Crown. Crown's defense here at the end. And then he's able to clean up Duke as well, cornering him against the turret, then using the zone of the turret as defense and taking him down with the laser. Lane surviving for Samsung is huge. Yeah, and even though Bengi's got that giant CS advantage on Ambition, they don't have Pink Ward control in the Dragon area, and they need to actually go and take some pressure back, which is they're going for now. Shot they wave on the two, and that's just easy. And wow. Wow. gets done through the poppy. Not to mention that subjugate you talked about. Baker, though, fighting in the brush. He was indeed. Shockwave still available. He traded a lot of damage. Voice of Light. Faker gets Command Protect. Two Shock Barrage is sidestepped. Crown doesn't get the kill. Crown was trying to bait him into that two-shot barrage. Uh, Faker didn't quite take it, but pretty close little 1v1 there. Yeah, worst trade Faker has taken in this lane. He's going to be forced into a recall, and I wonder if Ambition would want to go for the kill. No, oh. oh, not if you miss. <laughs> what was the line there? Down and thwart that top lane push. Could another tower be secured? SKT seem better poised to defend. There is a ward behind them. SKT do have teleport available on Duke, but Qbay is keeping sight on Duke. Going for Faker! Faker is down! down! They've got him! Faker is down! Crown is pushing forward. It's at the cost of Ambition's life. Crown is zoning away SK Telecom. Another tower has fallen. 5,000 gold on the power play. Ambition makes the huge play on Jungle versus... SKT though, right for Elder. I think this is are running for Baron though yeah. right now. Trying to establish vision control and force oh, any skill. Go back and take that ambition. He's He's it. It. Ambition. ambition steals the Elder Dragon. He gets yeah, away. They're all still alive. This is a four Drake Elder Dragon. He lives. Ambition saves the game once again. Magnificent at layering his gravity shield. Uh, the gravity fields. Now Cheryl onto ambition. Blanks coming in from behind. And the fight's now going to break out. Gravity Field will pull Blank backwards. That should be the GA pop. Cell Division still available. Curtain Call interrupted. Very good title away. Oh, yeah. 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 He's found three. Oh. Blank charges up the Maelstrom. The Slingshot. Fakers down. Samsung get three. Quick shot. Just look like we talked about. The wards in. Can't find the stun just yet. Tidal Wave sends him fishing. Crown throwing down those death rays over and over. Blank is exhaust. The Curtain Call. The Gravity. Oh, bang, 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 bang. Kills. It's a double for Bang! Oh, holy! Bang comes up huge right there! Oh, under pressure. This is buying time for those super minions to pour in. Kick around. Crown's able to flash so he doesn't get caught. But Kube's down. And it's a war of attrition. They're just waiting for them. Oh! Them in a fight. Duke flashes forward. Chomps down to kill Crown. SK Telecom have got two. Make that three kills. The curtain call is a fitting end to the World Championship as Samsung Galaxy are being dove under their tower. SK Telecom have overcome every challenge. They are the undisputed best team in the world. The SKT reign continues. They win.